I think my favourite cup of tea, especially for special occasions, is lemon and ginger. But I do like all the, the herb teas. I love trying out new ones. My main passion is intercession. Uh, it's something that's been with me since I was eight years old. I, you know, one night in bed I woke up and uh, I, I knew I had to pray for my mother and um, I just prayed and went back to sleep. And in the morning my dad came to me and said Mum had nearly died of an asthma attack overnight. And I knew that God had called me to pray that prayer and, and I knew it was answered. Well, um, I've counted up to 22. So, and some of them were with my church before I came into YWAM and some with the, the Australian Prayer Network. But on the whole, most of them are with DTS outreaches that I've led or co-led. Yeah. Uh, I think it was in 1994. I've done a, a crossroads discipleship training school in Canberra and I'd been there for a couple of years uh, where I did um, School of Biblical Studies. And, and then the, the following year I um, staffed two crossroads schools and the second one, the outreach, was to Wyoming Newcastle. And at that stage um, the, the, they had the opportunity of um, getting Parkway Avenue, Elizabeth House, that was owned by the YWCA. And uh, uh, David Stevenson asked me to, to, the team really, to pray about, about whether we'd get the building or not. So we're all in the bus outside Parkway Avenue and praying. And uh, God just spoke to me really clearly to go and offer myself for staff at Wyoming Newcastle, which I did. And within six months, I was settled in there. <laughs> I think it might have been um, Mexico City, actually, when, when um, I co-led a DTS outreach. And um, yeah, it was involved with Mega Cities first. And uh, yeah, we, we just saw, I saw God do miracles much easier. I saw seven people come to the Lord in, in one day. From Wyoming Newcastle, I, there's so, been so many stepping stones, but I think really the key one was finally getting a building that we owned at, at the warehouse because we rented and leased things and it just seemed like we were getting somewhere then. To, yeah, I remember that day too. When we opened the doors and all walked in. <laughs> yeah, it was an exciting time. Ginger beer <laughs> is my favourite. Yeah, I've always got it in the fridge, and it's really handy because of the most of the young ones like it too. So um, if they, I can't get them a cup of tea, I'll say, "Here's a ginger beer. Will you have a ginger beer?" Most of them like that. <laughs> yeah, I've th thought about this one a lot, and. Uh, I think I want to say I'm branching more into mercy ministries. So I think I think we might have a few ships, <laughs> and uh, in ten years, <laughs> and um, yeah, like continuing to increase in schools, increase the special training, training young people up is leadership, and multiplying like New Street and the, out, out to the world and increasing it here in Newcastle as well.